So Kevin, this one's for you. I set up this uh, base amp simulation from last night's jam, the 11079 one we did for Alan's birthday on August 14th. And so I took your direct base that we took from your jam and uh, I got two simulated rooms and mic base cabinets as if I did them live. So on the left over here, if you could see my mouse pointing to it, that we're going to use to simulate your lows. That's an actual base amp simulator. And we have a choice of three between uh, going from small base amp to large one to the largest. So I'm going to pick the largest at this point. I have the master up pretty high, the normal volume down low, the bass boosted in the mids and the trebles uh, kind of pulled back a bit. Down here I have a little fatness added to it over here and right here you could see this is the direct and amplifier only like mix knob and we do have the ability to move uh, the microphones back and forth so anyway let's give it a listen right here so right now it's gonna be during passenger your bass is soloed at this point once again this is currently bypassed uh, on both amp simulators the bass one on the right one by the way I didn't mention is a guitar simulator so I'm gonna have it set to like some sort of brown uh, Fender old-time amplifier and we'll see what we could do so right here it's a uh, direct sound no amplifiers just what you have We have a good signal, which came out good. Direct you sound good. You got that nice clippy sound that you like. Of course it's dry. So first I'm going to turn on the low cabinet, the bass cabinet over here on the left. Now that's just the low cabinet and it does take away quite a bit of that clippiness that you seem to enjoy. So let's see if we can get it back by adding this guitar cabinet over here. Let's see what we can do. I'm going to unbypass that right now. So that is kind of like uh, I think what you're looking for. God knows I'm not looking for it, but I think you're looking for it. Now, I think this one's relatively too loud, so I think I'm, I had this output turned down a bit, so I'm going to just turn the left one up a bit, try to balance it out a bit, turn the volume down on this one, it's down to like two on the knob, so it's pretty soft. That's probably what you're looking for. Now, I'm going to see if I could turn this to the left. This is the actual software. And even though there's a uh, glare, it's not too bad. Right here you can see that this is your actual bass. And I have it bust to the bass low, which goes to the bass cabinet and bass high. And then these two get bust over here to the final bass uh, mix or the bass bust. So you can see I turn that down, we have nothing. So that's it. Uh, it's the only effect I've worked on so far. I, I really haven't even worked on the tone yet, but I know this effects company I use has this amp simulator that I'm now demoing for 14 days. Uh, I tried it once before, it's very good. You know, look at it, you could bring the microphone back, you get more room sound to it, you get more speaker crunch as you get close, change the uh, access on it. Yeah, that's a little more clippy for you. Let's see what happens when we move this one back a bit. That, that was uh, the end of a loop. That's funny, it just ended right there. See, that makes it more roomy. And when I say roomy, more of the room. But this definitely brings it more clippy, like you like it. Uh, this is off axis. I don't like that on this one. I'm going to pull that one back. I like a little more room on that one. And I kind of like the off axis on the bass one. I'm going to add a little more bass to that one. And compare 
compared to uh, nothing, I guess. Here is a two solo. So the, nothing. So that's pretty cool, and that's before applying any effects or anything except for these two amp simulators, you know. So now I can go. I guess there's no, there won't be a need to EQ it, and when I listen to it in the mix, uh, which this is the raw mix, I haven't done anything yet, we'll see how it sounds, so anyway, I just want to give you a flavor of what this is all about, I'm sure you enjoy it, you wish you were doing it yourself, but it's pretty cool, see you later.